Hi guys, welcome to MML Motorhouse, and uh, we've got a very quick video tour, it's only a quick tour today, of a little Audi A1, it's a lovely little car. Um, so, bit of a story with this one, I won't bore you, but this is gonna be on the market super cheap. We're gonna make this an absolute bargain for someone, and the reason we're gonna do that is it needs a little bit of work. Um, we took this car in as a part exchange, we specialise in Jaguar Land Rover. Customers bought a new Range Rover Sport from us and they wanted to chop the Audi in. Uh, it made the deal work and so it's a lovely little car but it's not really what we do. Our workshops are absolutely rammed at the moment with customer cars that we're trying to get out before Christmas. So we don't really have the time to get into this one. So we just thought what we'll do, we'll get it online, make it cheap for someone. So it's a really nice way into an Audi A1. Um, we know there's a bit of work. It hasn't got an MOT on it at the minute. We haven't had a detailed look at it, but what we can see just from a glance is that it's gonna need new brakes all round. Um, also, it seems to us that the suspension just looks a little bit low at the front. We might be wrong, but it just looks a bit low at the front. Um, so there might be a bit of work to be done to get this car through an MOT. But what we will do is we'll make sure we leave loads of headroom in it. So it's just a really good way for someone to get into an Audi A1, hopefully grab themselves a bargain. You can do a little bit of work and then you've got a really good car. Um, we just simply, I wish we did, but we just don't have the time here to get into this one. So here we go. That's the backstory on the Audi. But it's a lovely little TFSI. It's petrol, um, really small engine. I think this is the little 1.2. So super good on the tax and the insurance. Um, car starts and runs really well. Clutch and gearbox feel really good. Um, the owner had it before, said they just didn't really use it. Um, whether I'm not sure if it was bought for their daughter to learn it, I'm not sure, but they didn't use it and they just wanted to sort of put it against the one they were buying. So here we go. So an interesting car to buy. Hopefully a nice bargain for someone. It looks great in this colour. I, I don't, I'm not sure what the exact colour is, but it's almost like a maroony purple, so it's quite unusual. Um, let's just give you a quick quick guide around it. We won't go too crazy on it, but um, lovely and straight down the sides. You know, the actual car itself seems to be in really good condition. You know, the alloys aren't too bad, a few little curbs on them. We haven't even valeted it, so I apologise it's not prepped to normal standard. Tires look really good. Again, you'd have to sort of do, you know, make your own mind up, but they look good from a visual inspection. Car itself, not too bad. A couple of little marks here on the door. Can you just see down on the door there? You might need a little bit of, bit of touching in, bit of paint, a little bit of a rust spot there. It's not gone through the car, it's just obviously where it's been chipped, but probably could be doing a little bit of paint there or maybe touch that in. But other than that, not too bad. Rear alloy and tire looking really good. Like I say, the actual car itself seems to be in lovely condition. It's got rear parking sensors on it. You know, it's nice on the bodywork. Actually, really nice colour, isn't it? Sort of changing colour as I go round it. Um, I've got the floodlights from this side of the warehouse on it, and it almost looks more purpley. But, yeah, nice little thing. Really cute. Looking down there on the driver's side. A little bit of a ding here. A little bit of a shopping trolley dent around there. It's not actually that easy to see. Uh, but just there, can you just see there? Might want to get a little dent man on that. Rear tyre, it's got a spot on it there, so it's obviously quite a new tyre on the rear. A little bit of a scratch there, that could probably be polished out. It doesn't seem to have gone through the paintwork. Again, we're not trying to oversell this car, so it's just a nice, honest video, just so you can make your mind up. You might want to come and see it, you might want to have the car delivered. Either way, it's just nice for you to, to get a feel for it. Front wheel good there. Uh, there's a little bit of a scuff here on the front. So this is on the front. So we've got a little bit that has sort of dented the paintwork there. So just bear that in mind. Some of that might polish out, but you have got a bit of a dent there and it just runs down to the lower part of the car. So just bear that in mind on the front driver's, front driver's wing. So there is a bit to do. Look, a bit of trim missing here. Just bear that in mind. So you're gonna to have to get a bit of plastic trim in there. That's just dirt. So there are bits to do, you know. It needs to go through an MOT. It's going to need brakes, possibly some work on the suspension. It's going to need a little bit of body work. I missed this earlier. I didn't mean to, but I didn't see that. There's a little bit of a ding there as well on the front. So again, nothing obvious, but these are great cars and they're actually quite expensive for what they are. So again, we're going to make this super cheap so someone can pick themselves up a really nice bargain. You can spend a few quid on it. We'll leave enough money in it so you can sort of spend some money on it, get it good, and hopefully it'll be a cheap way into an A1. Seats are all very nice, probably could do a bit of a clean. You know, the bolsters are good. Really wearing well. Rear the car very clean. 
it's actually a really nice little thing. It just needs a bit of, just needs a little bit of uh, love and tender care. 80,000, that's just flicked off, 80,000 miles. So nice on the mileage. You've got your radio SD card. We've got five speed gearbox here. Like I say, it needs a bit of a clean. This area here, this is your screen that comes up for your radio and your Bluetooth. It's not working. So again, that needs to be factor some attention into that. Getting that working is going to be important. But overall, not too bad. Steering wheel's really good. You know, it's just nice and clean. So there we go. Not one of our longest video tours. Um, really just to kind of give you a, a feel for the car. You're welcome to come down and look at the car. We do do delivery as well. So there's loads of options for us. But fundamentally, this is a part exchange trade sales. There's no warranty on the car. It's sold as seen. Um, like I say, we'll make it a really good price for someone so that it's a cheap way into an A1. But as long as you're aware, there's a bit of work to be done. We just want to be open and honest about that. And hopefully it can work for everyone. Give us a call, an email, a message or a WhatsApp. We're always here. We always love to help. Hopefully we'll speak to you soon.